Welcome to Sergei's Chemistry. Today's topic is hydrogen carbonate tests. So there are three main ideas. Hydrogen carbonates decompose on heating, forming carbonates, which are first mainly insoluble and second strong alkalis in contrast to hydrogen carbonates. To understand this better, let's look at two typical examples of soluble carbonate, sodium carbonate, and sodium hydrogen carbonate. Let's check pH first. It's clear that on the right we have a strong alkali and weak one on the left. Test with phenolphthalein is important for one of the tests which follows later. Hydrogen carbonate it's pink. In carbonate though it's red violet. Now let's check solubility. We use magnesium sulfate salt as an example, and let's add carbonates and hydrogen carbonates to it. Hydrogen carbonates are soluble, carbonates though are insoluble. First we add magnesium sulfate to the tested solution, which should remain clear though white precipitate should appear on heating. Here for the positive result we use sodium hydrogen carbonate, adding few drops of magnesium sulfate. Color shouldn't change, no precipitate should appear. This is a part of the test. Now let's see what would happen on heating. These bubbles which appear is not because of boiling. This is carbon dioxide, result of decomposition of hydrogen carbonate. Another result of decomposition, carbonate ions would cause precipitation of magnesium carbonate. Before heating, it should look like that. And that's after heating. Now let's look at second test with phenolphthalein. It's just checking growing pH on heating. For the positive result, we use the same sodium hydrogen carbonate and add phenolphthalein. On addition, solution should be just pale pink. That's part of the test. And then let's heat it up. Production of carbonate, which is a strong alkali, would drive pH up, changing, causing the change of the color for the indicator. So before heating it should look pale pink, after heating violet red. Thank you for watching, please subscribe to the channel, see you next time, bye!